Hey everybody, Jacob with Scooters Lawn Care. Today I'm gonna to go over how to set up your client portal, what you can view in there, and a little bit about how to use the new app. We strive to have awesome technology to make our service and everything about it seamless and amazing for our clients. So this is what we invest really heavily into to make sure your experience is awesome. So let's get right into this. So once you are gonna get things started, you're gonna get an email. This is just a test email from us where you're gonna be able to click here and get into your client portal. The client portal has been updated. Please log in with your current username and password. So here's where we're gonna go back to this email. We're going to copy these. I find the easiest way is to just copy and paste. Then you know you don't get anything wrong um, because after this, it's gonna ask you to redo it. So now we're gonna log in. Now we're gonna set up a username. Okay, so now it's gonna have you set up a username. I just put in Jacob Godar. You can go on to the next step. It walks you right through it. Now you're gonna do a password. Now you're gonna to have to go through your security. Whatever is easiest for you to remember. For you guys seeing how we do this, I, I want you to be able to see. So I'm never gonna remember this password. Here I accept all the new terms and services. This new update that our system's done has made it so much easier to view information. So we're currently logging in, and now all that has been processed, and here's where I'm gonna put my information back in. Okay, we're now logging into the back end of the system. This is getting updated all the time. They're making this better and better and better, and functions are getting better and better in the system. So I'm gonna show you when there's an invoice sitting on your account, what that looks like. So if we were to add a new invoice right now for some kind of landscaping. Now if we go back to your client portal, this should reflect that immediately. So you always see what is in the system. You'll be able to go into it, you'll be able to view what it's for, how to pay it, everything. You'll be able to see the PDF version if you want to print this off. Um, this also keeps reoccurring bills. This keeps all kinds of different things. The transactions list, there has been some issues where it hasn't been showing the paid invoices. Um, we're going we're gonna to demo that out right now so you can see if it does or if it doesn't because I've been interested. I've been wanting this, to see this for everyone. But so here, we're going to go ahead and we're going to enter a payment for a dollar save and close of a check and we're going to see how this looks now so here's the system everything's getting updated daily they're making this better they're rolling out so many improvements on this back end to make it even better for our clients but now all invoices are paid you can see what's been paid and you can go in and view the details about what you paid on in the past other new exciting things are scheduled services this is a really great spot so you can see what services you have if you want to change this you can change this it's very easy for you to keep up on your current services and then a new really exciting thing is tickets in our system tickets are how we know everything that's how we manage estimates make sure we remember things we're on top of things and currently this feature is not turned on but we will be opening this up because this just got released where now you can submit a ticket and it notifies our office and this is a really really interesting thing a really a good way to see what's currently going on in your account you know it shows this last email that comes into our system as a ticket if there was some kind of to do something we needed to do something that you wanted done uh, that can be inserted as a ticket as well and then you have your general area where there's your account information if you want to update for auto pay put your credit card on file it's very easy so you know when you put your credit card on file you're not putting it with us you are putting it with a secure merchant provider where we are required to be PCI compliant to even use their services and we never have that information we're only able to apply it to the current bills you have you can update any information and this is going to build out more and more and more to my understanding we're also going to have have estimates that are open and all this information show on here so here's another commitment another thing we've been doing investing in to make sure you have the best possible service with our company because we invest in technology that makes things seamless and better for you